Dover Beach. Dover Beach is located in the middle of the very popular St. Lawrence Gap on the south coast of Barbados. The wide and expansive beach is popular for a variety of water sports including hobby cat sailing, jet skiing, boogie boarding and windsurfing. Although there are no strong currents in this area, the sea is quite active. A lifeguard is on duty at the beach to ensure your safety. Adjoining the beach are several stalls where you can purchase drinks, ice cream, snacks, t-shirts, snorkel gear, sunscreen, sunglasses, food and much more. Bashiba and the surrounding areas. On the east coast of Barbados, huge Atlantic waves crash along the shore, making these beaches better suited for adventuring than for swimming. The sea ain't got no back door. This means the sea is not a safe place since there is no guarantee that you will get back out. Although the Atlantic coastline is stunningly beautiful and the sea appears quite inviting, swimming is not recommended along this coast as there are very strong and dangerous currents and no lifeguards on duty. However, there are a few good places you can take a dip in with some small pools formed close to shore, creating natural swimming pools. The soup bowl located at Bashaba is the surfer's choice. Catawash offers breathtaking landscapes with ample picnic space as the well-known Barclays Park is a popular picnic spot for locals on bank holidays and weekend excursions. Further north is the remote Morgan Lewis Beach, a popular spot for horse riding along the beach. To the south are numerous beautiful bays. Some of the more popular ones are Tent Bay, Martins Bay, also known for its excellent seafood, and Skeets Bay. Others to mention are Bottom Bay and Bath Beach. Bath Beach having one of the very few natural flowing freshwater streams. Fuxton Beach. Fuxton Beach is considered a family beach and is a very popular beach with both locals and visitors to the island. The sea at Fuxton Beach is clear, calm and warm and very safe for swimming. It's an excellent area for snorkeling. Its inshore reefs are home to many different tropical fish and other marine life including sea anemones, sea lilies, corals and sponges. Snorkeling equipment is available for hire and glass bottom boats can take you a little further out allowing you to observe the amazing abundance of sea life without getting wet. Folkestone Museum is a major feature of the Folkestone area with the Visitor Interpretation Center for Public Viewing and Education. This features an aquarium with many interesting and rare marine species, including sea eels. Folkestone Beach is a very popular diving location, accommodating the Strava Nikita, a purposely sunk ship over 120 feet below the water's surface. Haywoods Beach, located in the northwestern parish of St. Peter, near to the town of Spikestown, is this wide, quiet beach. Here you'll find a large open area ideal for swimming and smaller rock enclosed pools that are perfect for children to wade in. As with most beaches along the west coast, the waters here are very calm. The shallow reefs are good for snorkeling and other water sports are available nearby.
Okay guys, I hope you've enjoyed this video. As always, don't forget to like and subscribe and share this video with those who are coming to Barbados so everyone can learn a bit about the amazing beaches we have here, including those bonus beaches. I will see you in the next one. Bye-bye.